Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Just a quick roundup and clarification today of some recent Anthem news coming out of the Bioware studios. For those who don't know, Anthem is an online multiplayer RPG putting players into high-tech exosuits allowing exploration of a vast open world environment. It's slated for a 2018 release but no set date as yet. The potential for this game is huge and it already has the gaming world ravenous for more information. And information we have, kind of. This weekend Bioware held a review and parts of it were covered by the game's producer Alan Baxter. Nothing huge was officially announced apart from this image apparently teased. It shows something called the chart of exploration. It's full of smaller images or place markers which aren't easy to make out. It also shows the outline of planets in an orbit too. Nothing is massively clear here though, but it makes for some great speculation. I myself was intrigued by this and thought if it is tied to the game, then the potential of these being quests or objects to find in the game would mean the scope of this game was bigger than first thought. Now, the following was highlighted by a good friend of mine from YouTube and Twitter at Bill Me Now Gaming. If you haven't already, then go and check him out. He's a big part of the community on Twitter and shows great support for everyone involved. He's going to be a prominent part of Anthem going forwards too, so I'll leave links below for you guys to go and follow him. So, he did a bit of digging around this image and it turns out that this image is actually the chart of cosmic exploration. It's a poster and a PC background image. It was originally put together by Pop Chart Labs and it seeks to track our actual history of space travel and exploration. It traces the trajectories of every orbiter, lander, rover, flyby and impactor to ever slip the surly bonds of Earth's orbit and successfully complete its mission. However, if you put the two images together, the one from the review and the one from the poster, there's instantly a big difference between the two. The colour coded key is set on the right side of the image, as opposed to the bottom in the actual poster. So could it be that Bioware have actually used the poster as a concept for inspiration in their game and we are going to use this chart as a roadmap of our exploration and advancement in the Anthem universe? Or is it just a reimagined version of the poster to use as a screensaver to inspire work going on within the studio? We just don't know. The similarities are plain to see, but that slight adjustment of the key code just might mean that this is an in-game tracker of some sorts based on the poster and used for inspiration. There's been no word from Bioware on this or Alain Baxter who posted the images other than more Anthem news is coming very, very soon. So we'll have to wait and see on this one. Let me know what you think of these two images. Is it just a coincidence or is it something more related to the game? Now, just to let you guys know, I'm going to be covering Anthem on the channel going forwards as and when we get more news and closer to its release date, hopefully later on this year. So, please let me know what you think of this in the comments section below. Remember to also please like and subscribe to the channel for more future content. Find me on Twitch and also follow me on Twitter. Thanks for watching. Cheers.